hello this is john and today i'm going to uh, discuss with you uh, some changes uh, to the circuit to the brushless neumann motor circuit so as you can see i have two addition the first addition is a uh, 360 ohm one watt resistor and I place it between the base of the transistor and the emitter. And the second addition is a neon bulb uh, between the collector and the emitter. Both, the, bo bo both components, the resistor and the neon bulb, they are added to protect the transistor from from warm up from become hot and to blow up because the transistor is the heart of the system all right now this is the circuit you remember it all right with this what these two additions but this is the same circuit this is the same circuit but designed to be to be a, 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 a replicate on a pcb this is a pcb design of the circuit so if you make a screenshot of of uh, this uh, circuit so you can replicate it on a pcb so uh, the whole uh, the whole you see here those 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 white dot, they are where you drill. You have to drill them. Drill those holes. Drill those hole. Those holes. This is hole. The three hole design to put the the transistor. But this transistor is not a two N three zero five five. This transistor where the two pin are aligned on the same line is MJL. 211-94G. This is the transistor I use for this circuit. But you can use the the 2N30055. This is the one you had. But, but this is the emitter. This is the collector. And this is the base. You have to respect this order. Emitter, collector, base. Whatever transistor you, you use, MJL 211194G or 2N30055, you must put a, a, a put them on this on on this PCB circuit in this way. The emitter must be here, the collector must be here, and the base must be here. All right. Now. Let's see the. This is the, the circuit on a on a piece on a piece of plywood. Uh, I glue the the picture on a piece of plywood and drill them and uh, glue them. You see, not glue not glue them. Uh, a solder the comp the components but what is this what is this one this one what is this this one is a uh, here it is this this one maybe five or six millimeter wide it's a, a copper tip uh, with uh, with adhesive conductive adhesive with conductive adhesive so this is what i use to make the uh, the, the the design the the, the 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 pcb design you see what i did 
you see when you glue the after you glue the the the, the picture you drill the holes you drill all the holes after you drill you drill all the holes you go at the back and you you as you see here you you make a, a drawing of of the of the of the hole you 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 connect the hole with a drawing with uh, a, a, a a marker as you as you see here you make a marker and you join the draw to, to get together according how it, ap it appears here how it appears uh, on respect where you you connect the the dot according to the to the uh, to the picture after that you put the adhesive on the on the line you connect the line with the adhesive yeah the, the tip the, uh, the, 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 the tip the tip adhesive the tip the copper tip the copper tip which is adhesive uh, which have an equal conductive adhesive you will see there is this stripe join this stripe but there is there is no solder here but the, only the adhesive make the connection it, it, here too here too there is no there is no 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 a, a, a solder here but the adhesive make the connection here too here too the adhesive make the connection so it's a conductive adhesive copper tip conductive adhesive copper tip this is what you use to make uh, it it make life way easier if you would like to to replicate this this uh this circuit on a pcb you can do it if you have the patience and and the and the uh, the 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 product to do it because it's very 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 not com not very complicated but it it uh, 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 add you must have some uh, some uh, some design it's way complicated than this one way complicated than this one all right so this is what I, I I wanted to share with you. So if you want to replicate this uh, circuit, the PCB design, you can do it. You can do it. You can make a, a screenshot of it right now. And uh, actually, you don't you don't need the the adhesive to make. To make the the connection you can make the connection with wire with a copper wire that's it you can make the connection with copper wire so it's a a a, a way ready to go a a a a, a, a components or or a, a design i, I would i uh, will try to upload this picture in the description if it is possible so check the des description to see if the picture is there in it i will try to make it available for you and uh, this uh, circuit is not a a battery charger it's a circuit driver for the bedini motor and the uh, Newman motor. So I'm going to use it uh, 
with the Bedini first and after that with the Newman motor. You will see the, it's going to drive both of them. Okay, now this fan is connected to this is connected to the circuit. This fan is a, a fan computer a rebuilt and rewind to uh, to to one with a Bedini circuit. But this circuit is going to to run this fan as well. I give it a spin. Okay, it runs the the Bedini fan motor. Let's pause it. So this is the circuit. Is running the human motor without any problem. So let's resume our talks today. Our talk today needs uh, changes made to the uh, brushless Newman motor circuit uh, that I, which I rename a uh, brushless Newman Bedini motor circuit driver because it's a circuit driver. So two changes. Uh, I add. Uh, a neon ball between the collector and the emitter and I add a transistor a resistor 360 ohm 1 watt resistor between the base and the collector designed to uh, protect the transistor and the transistor I use in this setup is MJL 211194G transistor but you can use uh, the you can use the 2N303055 if this is the one you have but respect the pin respect the pin uh, this is for the collector the, the center tap is the for the collector and the the left is e for the emitter and the base b for the base respect that and you good to go i hope you enjoyed the video and before i go check the 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 uh, the description to see if it was possible to 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 make to make the uh, this circuit the 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 PCB design circuit available in the description. Check it. So that's that's all for today. See you next time. Goodbye.